Welcome back, everybody. This is Frank DeMore with The Last Chronicles of Planet Earth. If you're at the YouTube channel, you just discovered my channel, you can go to my website, which is www.bibleprophecyman.com, or just look up The Last Chronicles of Planet Earth. You'll be able to get there, and you'll see a link like this under my book. You can click it, and you can download the book today for free. Now, I'm going to be talking about the Revelation, because in Revelation, uh, Jesus shows us in Revelation chapter 13 and Revelation chapter 17 and also in the book of Daniel. Specifically, you could look in chapter 2 and chapter 7 of the book of Daniel. You'll see the rise of the Antichrist. And in chapter 13, we see that he controls the entire economy because the Lord told us that he's going to be able to make it so that nobody will buy anything or sell anything unless they had the mark of this Antichrist who will come. And when he comes, he'll be coming, uh, proclaiming peace, but he brings war and destruction. And so there's been a lot of anxiety about um, people, leaders, controlling everything. And we've seen this in the past. But there's an article that came out today that says, Anxiety over upcoming test of the U.S. emergency system. And uh, this article says it's only a test, but nerves are somewhat frayed over the first nationwide exercise of the system designed to alert Americans of the national emergencies. The test occurs at 1900 GMT Wednesday, and this would be, I believe it would be uh, 7 o'clock, uh, November the 9th of this year. So it's only uh, three or four days away and may last over 3 minutes no longer than the typical or uh, longer than the typical 30 seconds or 1 minute for most broadcast broadcast test messages and according to this message being circulated by the local school and government officials there is great concern in in local police and emergency management circles about the undue public anxiety over the test. So what they're trying to tell you essentially, and I'll leave you the link, is that uh, don't worry about this. This is something that's going to be beneficial for the United States and it's only a test and to tell everybody about it. But this is really a system that would be able to control uh, everything essentially. So has it been done in the past? Well, you better believe it has. Take a look at this. When Iran had protests uh, Iran's government, what did they do? They shut down the internet. And here's one of the articles about it. It talks about two days before the new round of planned protest against Iranian President Mohammad Ahmadinejad, network access in the nation's capital is largely uh, down, according to this French newspaper here. So we see that there is the capability now to shut down uh, television, Internet, and I believe also, it, when they're talking about the FCC communications, they'd be able to shut down your cell phones as well. So, for example, uh, there's a kill switch um, that this had to be passed by the uh, this bill that went through, and it says a new Senate bill sponsored by Senator Joe Lieberman proposes to give the president the authority to seize control or even shut down the portions of the internet. So there's a lot of concern that as we move towards the last days, nations, leaders will have the power to control the people completely. And for example, in Europe where they have these riots and now they're going for these austerity budget concerns and people are becoming violent and they don't want to uh, continue with these mass movements, they could shut down this system. If it happened in the United States because of what they're going through with their budget cuts and you know there was more hostility as we've been seeing in Oakland, California with these marches. If the government wanted to declare this an emergency, guess what? The bill passed. He could have the kill switch and shut down so people couldn't coordinate these functions. So the capability of handing a system like this with our new technology to the Antichrist is already here. He'd be able to control the economy. He'd be able to control everything, essentially. So, And this could only happen in our generation. And the book of Daniel showed us in chapter uh, 12 that our generation would be the one known for the increase in knowledge, and we are.